Hello everyone and welcome back to Ordering Chaos 2 Redemption where we are still in the heated quest of trying to find this Cormier guard and talking to him. But before we do that, let's take a look at my free chest. <gasps> I have a sneeze. Oh my god. Rest in peace headphone users. Alright, let's use this superior chest. I actually got this one uh, I think a day or two ago but I decided not to use it just because I wanted to save it for a video. Essence of Red Oxide. This is like the... This is, I, I've seen a lot of the items that are used to make red oxide as of late. What did that just say? It's free in a matter of seconds, in 16 seconds. There goes, there goes Smo. But where is this Cormier guard? I thought it was going to be that, that one, like, right over there. Social media! <laughs> I love it. That's so funny. Just an announcement that says social media. How are you guys? How have you been? I haven't recorded Order in Chaos 2 in a little while. I actually wanted to do a video on the game Spirit Hunter that just appeared on the App Store. I haven't played it just yet, and there is still a chance that I might play it afterwards. But man, I am feeling like playing an RPG today. But man, I am feeling like opening an ancient chest for free. A royal fork! Exactly what I wanted. Wait, that's not a Koromir guard. What is this? Is this a portal to go inside? Whoa, this is a pretty town. Oh, so I guess we were just kind of outside of Koromir for a little while. Here we go. Koromir is the most prosperous city in Herodon, as well as the economic center of the Armenian em Armyrian Empire. Uh, you can regard Koromir as a convenient hub for all the game's features. Nice. Okay, so I guess I'll be doing a lot of trading and stuff here as I continue. I'll tap that to make it go away. I've also been playing a lot of Call of Champions. Heavens, I really like that game. It's... It's exactly what I wanted in a MOBA. Wow. I take it this is the Cormier Guard. Hey man, you're important actually. Hello. You there, Halt, what business do I have in Cormier? Warn Barlow of what happened back in the town. Did you say happened in your town? No, if these horrors are true, then we've gotta let somebody in charge know. You go talk to Barlow. Hopefully he can help. Goodbye. Sounds good. A word of warning. Let's go let him know what happened because holy shiz, that was actually scary. I, like I said, I kind of dug that twist at the end there. If you haven't seen it, go watch it. But it actually ended up being uh, less of a fetch quest and more of an impending disaster on a town. Which is a really fun way to get people into the game right off the bat. Do I have stuff to sell? I know that I'm now boasting a golden fork. So upon further inspection, that guy just has a lot of class-specific stuff that I don't really feel like messing around with. How about you? Buy today, enjoy forever. Lucky Cross Merchant, is this all a whole bunch of... Ah, this is a bunch of, like, aesthetic stuff. I'm looking for utility, ma'am. Wait, what? This is exactly what the last person had. Is this- are you glitching out on me? I've got items you won't see. May your young- Uh, I think that person's glitched out. Because they have the same exact items that the last person had. I don't really need any of this right now, so we're just gonna carry on with our quest. Excuse me, excuse me, folks. Sorry about this. I wonder, I, I wonder if I should stream this tomorrow. That might actually be really fun. I'll consult everyone before the stream starts, but we'll see if people want to see Blitz Brigade or uh, if people want to see Blitz Brigade or Order and Chaos 2. I'm sure a lot of people are streaming Order and Chaos 2 right now, but I haven't streamed Order and Chaos 2. That's why. Move aside, statue. Who put this here? Interesting, so I just collected a whole bunch of rewards from different things. I probably, hopefully, remember to cut that out just because I wasn't really talking. I didn't remember. I was trying to figure out what that was. I'm digging all the trees. I'm digging the aesthetic of this place. This really nice. Barlow, are you up here? If so, nice digs. Wow, this, this scale is incredible. I'm so loving these trees. Oh my god, look at this one. It's pink. That's so different. You're so you're so unique, tree. Ah, oh, there we go. That must be Barlow. Usually important people have blue beacons coming down from the dang. sky. You look like you've seen quite a fright. What's going on? Yeah, dude, I'm scarred horribly. You should have seen Rose. That's a pretty tell tall tale you're telling me. How do I know that you aren't just some wandering lunatic escape from the asylum? Trust you? You'll excuse me if I don't have a lot of a lot of that to give right now. But I will tell you this, I've heard rumors that a man named Maxwell may have been telling a story similar to yours. You find him, have him corroborate your story, and I'll believe you. Why would I believe him and not you? Simple. He's rich, and money buys a lot of things, including trust. You can find him over in the Manor District. Holy truth! Wow. Agreed. Let's go find him. Wealthy area of Korobir. 
Is there a short... There's no shortcut by this tree. Why is it making me, like, cut by this tree? Oh, these stairs are gonna be fun to jump down. It's the little things in Order and Chaos, too. Like, jumping downstairs. <laughs> this has got to be one of the most enjoyable MMOs that I've played in a very long time. You know what I just recently rediscovered, thanks to Jacob, is the old RuneScape servers. Guys, did you know that I used to play a whole lot of RuneScape? RuneScape is one of those games, whenever I turn it on, I feel like I'm going home, you know? I really like that game a lot. It's very relaxing. I played a lot of it with my good friend Matt. He's been in a couple videos before. You guys should check it out. Browser MMO. Everybody makes fun of it for good reason. Yes, can I help you? No. No, you can't help me. I'm fine. <laughs> I'm doing just great. Just let me walk down these steps, man. Dang. Is this the wealthy area? I guess not. I kind of want to look around, but I'm sure that I'll be back here. They wouldn't build that into the game without it serving some sort of purpose, so I'll be back. They'll always come back. Let's turn on auto run. Wow. Manor district. This is so pretty. Holy shiz, man. Okay, this this looks very this looks wealthy. I imagine he's like right here. I guess not. What are you guys talking about? I am sure oh, these guys are selling armor. I wonder if I can auction off my golden razor and stuff. Because that that was like an auction auctioneer. Uh, look for Maxwell. Maxwell is nowhere to be found. Gotcha. I didn't even have to look. I was just told. He's nowhere to be found. He's not around here. Oh, whoa. Did I just... Did I just open this? Did I just like run into that and open that? I'm not entirely sure. Here, we'll come back. Uh, these are very nice houses. The grass is certainly greener over here, that's for sure. Oh. We can rob his place, though. Maxwell is long gone, but you see the remains of a burnt letter. I don't remember Maxwell. Burnt letter. Some sections are still visible. Seems like someone tried to destroy it, but left it before they could ensure the job was done. The return address says that the letter came from Fendir. And it is signed with an elaborate S. Perhaps there's a connection between the writer and Maxwell. Isn't that part of that group that that everyone was saying was coming back? Oh no, Maxwell, what have you gotten yourself into? Are you involved in some cult or something that's trying to bring about the end of the world? Because if so, we can't be friends. This dot thing is leading me to some weird locations. But sure, I'll trust you. You are the you are the the ever-knowing dot trail. You know better than I. Whoa! -ho! Wow, those weird slopes. Those weird slopes. How far away is Fendir? I wonder. Are there mounts in the game? Because that'd be that'd be really fun. I should see about getting some mounts. Oh, <laughs> those boxes. These boxes. I should probably cut out some of this travel time, too, because I don't know how long it's going to take. Although, I gotta say, this the traveling is very therapeutic. It's really nice. Do I have any mail? Do I have any mail? Does anybody want to talk to me? Winner, winner, Lottery Express. Yes! Thank you, finally! Somebody gets it. Yeah, we don't need that anymore. Ah, uh, here we go, and yet again we've reached another portal. Hopefully Fender's on the other side. Crosswind, here we go. So we're back. Actually, this is where we started. It's the, the crossroads, I'm assuming. I like that it's called uh, Crosswinds, and you can see the winds going through. Wow, look at the look at the rocks over there. Those big old monoliths. That's pretty. I'm really impressed by the set pieces in this game. I think that's why I like it a lot more than the original Order in Chaos, just because it's a lot more diverse in its landscape. Are you really going to have me go through here and not the, and not the bridge? Oh my god, this dot trail. Ah, I'm swimming! Can I go underwater? Nah, that... Oh, yes I can! This is cool. <laughs> I'm loving it. I'm really feeling it. A uh, dot trail? Can I, can I come up here? I guess I can. The dot trail knows not to send me over something that I can't climb up. This reminds me a lot of Elder Scrolls Online. 
I bet that's why I like it so much. Look at this! Dot Trail, you're silly. Why wouldn't I just take the road? Oh, because the road winds like crazy. Oh, here we go. We're in Fender now. Oh, it suddenly just got a lot drearier. Is this that dynamic weather again, or...? Search for the mysterious S person. A taste for adventure. Find Grand Inquisitor Godfrey in the town and hall and volunteer for guard duty. Wanted. Brave adventurers willing to stand up for criminals. Yeah. Two criminals, hopefully that's what that said. Wow, look at all these people apparently doing this quest. Let's talk about, let's find out about this guard duty really quick. Protect the merchant from the bandits while he travels the oak path. I'm down to do some side questing. Tell me about that oak path, Mr. Dot Trail. I guess it's down here. Are you the merchant that I'm supposed to be protecting? Yeah, let's go. I'm ready. I'm about as ready as I'll ever be. I like your horse. Nay, nay. Oh, wow. The weather got a lot more tropical all of a sudden. It's weird. You can tell like it's really humid just by the change in color. What? What are you seeing that I'm not seeing? Oh. I was gonna say, I don't I don't actually see what we're fighting here. I don't think they're prepared for my huge demons that sprout from my back. I think I've said it before, but the combat system kind of reminds me of Wild Blood. Oh hey, I have another chest. Man, they are just giving me, they are just giving these away. I mean, that's obviously what they're doing, but you know. Oh no, that doesn't pause the game. I'm a fool. Oh, these guys are all level six. That's good, I'm gonna be getting some good experience from this. You better hurry up and die, I gotta loot this wolf. Ah, they inflict bleeding. Let's keep going. It looks so silly when I carry my sword in one arm. Or in one hand, just because it's such a big sword. Oh, we made it. Also, thank you to whoever told me about uh, how the club is something that I can pick up. It's a random drop that, like, stuns enemies. Hello, bear! Bears are nothing in this game. Oh, hey, we can complete another quest while we're down here. Okay, that's all six of them. Nice, I didn't even think that I would be able to do more quests. I should probably check to see if the third one that I got is down here. Okay, I guess that was it. I could just do the two down here. Get... Stupid... Dot trail, the one time you overestimate my jumping capability. Dot trail, you're doing me wrong, man! Oh, great. That's, this was the... I leveled up. That was uh, that was the guy uh, who was offering the the flower quest. I think Godfrey's over here. Yeah, there he is. Perfect. I did it. Awesome. There we go. Who are you, and what can I do for you? No time to talk. I've got to focus on protecting the village. Oh, this is hello, stranger. Say so you're looking for a person whose name starts with the letter S. No, I think it's. In our village is being assaulted from all sides by bandits, pirates, and fanatics. Don't have time to listen to an entire census report for you. Uh, go bother the soldiers from the House of Stone. Wait, so you want me to travel back? Unlock new inscriptions. What are inscriptions? Each skill includes inscriptions. Unlock and learn these inscriptions to make your skills more powerful. You can set them here. Huh, do I want to do... I could do 40% more damage. Oh, I could do I could reduce their armor and resistance of your target by 20% which is pretty great I think I might actually do that yeah I think I'm actually going to do sunder cool and I still have one skill point left I don't think that's enough to do anything no it's not enough to do anything why can't I put this I tried to do this last time I guess I'll just put it in there okay 
And we're all done here. So let's go see what else do we got going on in our quest book these days. Whoops, I clicked on the wrong one. There we go. Okay, I want to do some more fighting, so I set another protect. Kind of like, whoa, I'm getting some frame drops here. Whoa! Oh, it's because there's a lot of people. Whoa! <laughs> Man, I could count these frames. This is a slideshow. Welcome to my PowerPoint presentation of Order and Chaos 2. So, oh, Haunted Ruins. Wait, we gotta do this one instead. We gotta we gotta go see the Haunted Ruins. I'm down for some creepiness. Sorry about the frame drops here, but I promise I'm getting them too. It's not just YouTube. This is, this is just because there's a whole bunch of people at one point right now. It probably has something to do with me mirroring it too. I hopefully the performance of the game isn't this. Yeah, there we go. I'm slowly getting them back. And now we're back up to full, I think. Yeah, that's looking good. I guess it's just a matter of having how so many people on screen at once. Does anybody ever has anybody played that game Growl online? What what am I in combat with? And I'm getting attacked by nothing. Oh, what? What is that? Wandering Void Ghost? Oh my god, that's scary. Let's use my new my new technique. It's kind of interesting. I get wings. What in the heck was that? Oh my god, can we fight another? That's a bear. That is a bear. That's nothing nothing important. I bet that's Lyle over there. Oh no. Maybe it's not. But I kind of want to go read this gravestone anyway. Sorry, Lyle, you can wait. Oh, hidden treasure. Cool. Okay, let's talk to Lyle. Hello. There's a strange old man living in these ruins. Collect blood from the animals in the haunted ruins for Lyle. Okay. Well, this is somewhat disappointing. The malevolent spirit specter rumored to haunt these ruins appears to be nothing more than some crazy old hermit muttering to himself. I tried speaking with him. He was babbling on about an ancient city of Aristar or Aristas or something. And uh, people with powerful psychic abilities. He's probably crazy. But what if he's not? What if these really are the ruins of some ancient city and psionic beings? Their power might still linger here. If we're able to tap into it, think of the contributions we could make to paranormal science. I think that's a oxymoron. The Amber Order will no longer be able to dismiss my research, my research so easily. You can help me by collecting blood samples from the animals living in these ruins. I'll test it on the presence of psychic energy, and it'll draw living creatures. And blah blah. Some people can be so selfish. Oh, wow. Sure, I would uh, be more than happy to kill animals. I guess. Jeez, you're what a terrible guy. Am I trying to kill bears? Is that what he wants me to do? Because this is, this is, I feel terrible. I'm so sorry, bear. You get away from my loot. You get away from my bear loot. Ew, this, see, these guys are creepy. Look at them. These guys are actually terrifying. I could be using my abilities, or I could not do that. Oh, they don't bleed because they're ghosts. This sucks. Okay, let's go kill more bears. Stupid logic and your stupid rules. What, is it, what are the wings? I didn't read what the wings unfurled does. I should read it because I wonder if it does something besides damage because it's doing literally nothing. Well, it's doing something, but it's only doing like 16 damage, I think. See, and I crit. Oops, oopsies. I didn't actually think that I'd be able to loot this bear because I helped somebody else. I'm just not even going to bother with the ghosts, unless that was just a fluke and there's just a chance that they drop blood. That might actually be the case. If that is the case, then I'll have to fight some more ghosts to see what happens. But since there's a bear right here, I won't even bother at the moment. Just need one more animal. Okay, Mr. Void Ghost. Let's just see. Let's just see what's going on here. Do you secretly bleed? I don't see why you would. I'm not a ghost expert or anything, but I'd assume that ghosts don't really bleed. My bag is full. I hate my bag. My bag is my worst enemy. What in what in the world is that? I don't even know. Okay, but let's go kill this wolf because I just need I just need one more one more drop of blood and then we'll be okay. I should probably go sell stuff before I complete this mission actually.
Okay, let's go talk to him. I don't really want to run all the way back there. If I miss out an item, so be it. So, I don't really care. Oh good, nothing. I just got a whole bunch of experience. I'll go ahead and accept the follow-up though. But I think that's going to do it for today's episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm super loving Order and Chaos 2 still. A uh, really fun game, and unfortunately it gets those massive frame drops when you've got like 20 people on screen at once, but you know, that's kind of to be expected. Alright guys, talk to you later. Bye-bye.